Like any relationship, our intimacy with God will grow based on the amount of time we devote to the pursuit and building of the relationship. But time invested is meaningless if we are distracted. The primary reason we become distracted in our time with God is because we have not selected a sacred space in order to truly start listening to God. Psalm 68 verse 5 in the voice says, The true God who inhabits sacred space is a father to the fatherless, a defender of widows. Some of life's busy distractions for us include worries over what we read in the news, fear of failure in our jobs or academic performance, or stress over our health or finances, for example. To beat these distractions, we can choose to focus our thoughts on God. Isaiah 26 verse 3 in the New Living Translation says, You will keep in perfect peace all who trust in you, all whose thoughts are fixed on you. There are six ways to find or create sacred space. Those who live in less populated areas will find sacred space more easily, but those in heavily populated areas can create their own sacred space, even amidst the crowds. Here's how to do it. To find sacred space, consider these options. The forest. Those who live outside cities will find that any wooded area can provide the stillness and peace necessary to meet God. The mountain. Find an elevated spot overlooking your city, or simply a place to experience the peace, beauty, and stillness of nature. The water. There is nothing like a walk on the beach in the early morning or a location overlooking a lake or perhaps a walk alongside a river. You can also create sacred space. You have the walk. If you live in the city, it is absolutely possible to map out an intricate and creative walk through the neighborhood. The music. Sometimes you find yourself in the midst of noise. A great pair of headphones combined with a spiritual playlist will create sacred space even in the midst of noise. You can make your own spiritual playlist by finding songs that make you think of God to help you shift your focus to Him. The closet. If all else fails, you can read or pray in a smaller space, or create a closet in your backyard, or a special table tucked into a corner. This with a cup of coffee or tea and a favorite treat, and you will quickly find yourself being able to read and pray with your total attention on God. You can check out more at deepspirituality.net.